Hi, it's Joan Pagano with the third article in the series of 10 entitled The Best Exercises for Osteoporosis Prevention. This one deals with which exercises you should avoid if you've been diagnosed with osteoporosis. A woman who had been diagnosed came to me for a fitness consultation. She was so stymied by her diagnosis that she had stopped exercising completely. There are many safe and effective exercises that you can do as long as you follow safety guidelines such as those put forth by the National Osteoporosis Foundation that pertain to specific movements, positions, impact loading, and jarring of the spine or hip. Of course, the first thing you should do if you're just beginning an exercise routine or intensifying one is check with your doctor or healthcare provider to make sure that the exercises are right for you. Please read the article, learn from it, share it with those who may benefit, and let me know what you think. And remember to stay tuned. This is only the third article in the series of 10 entitled The Best Exercises for Osteoporosis Prevention that will be released one a week. Thank you.